guys, it's me Natalie. Welcome back to my channel. Um, and my neighbors are watching. It's so pretty outside. I'm living for it. So today I thought it would be super duper fun if I did a little like tutorial on how to do like these. Basically, it's a tutorial on how to, like, paint these shorts and make them super, like, aesthetic and cute. Because where I live, it was, like, snowing before, but it's so nice now, so. So, I decided that I'm going to film the whole video outside, and I was going to do it right here, but I'm literally, like, a shadow, so. So, what you need for this tutorial is yellow fabric paint. This is from, I don't know, probably, like, Hobby Lobby or anything. Um, then you're going to need the like, paint, you can't really see it because my palette is like super messy, but there's like the color right smack in the middle. That's going to be the center of my flower, a brush, and also your shorts or pants that you're DIYing. If you're wondering what that is, I really don't feel like explaining it. Um... But it's like the thing that's connected to our kitchen and it helps vent out like all the steam and stuff. I just licked my pants, so that's my update. <laughs> so I'm gonna take this color with my brush and just start by painting on a little like base I guess for my flower like the center of my flower and I want mine this is kind of just like a rough if you know what I mean like it is going to be placed right there but it's not gonna this is just like a line where I'm gonna do it so I've just finished the like center of my flower and then the petals are going to come out from there so I'm just going to do the other side, and basically, to explain it, all I did was just color it in, or paint it in, so it's not really that complicated. I didn't feel like I really needed to, like, film that or anything. Okay, so I was kind of scared that the, like, circle things wouldn't be even, but I basically just, you know, made some minor changes to the one that I did first, and I think they turned out kind of similar. They look weird right now, because... It's just like these brown, greenish, brownish dots. But I'm going to add the petals now. And actually for this, I'm not going to be using the paintbrush. I might use the paintbrush a little bit to fill it in. But I'm just going to go ahead and draw them with this so I can have a way more detailed lining of it. And I can really control like what goes on with this. So I figured since the petals are a little bit harder, I guess, to draw, I'd give you a little more of a tutorial on these. Okay, I'm going to try and set this. Oh, it's filming. Oh, there's a leaf on it. So this is like an awkward angle. Um, hopefully this turns out, but I just wanted to demonstrate with like one petal for you guys. So basically I'm just going to take this and I hope this is in frame. Let's move it. Okay. I'm just going to take it and squeeze out, and I hope it doesn't, like, do any air bubbles or anything. And just make kind of, like, that shape right there. And then you're just going to put some more in there, and I'll probably spread it out with my paintbrush. Okay, so I just finished one side, and I think it looks pretty good. Um, can you, okay, hopefully you guys can see this, but I think it looks kind of pretty good. Uh, hopefully it looks good, because I kind of want to be so good. <laughs> so I'm now going to do the other side, and I'll catch up with you guys when I'm done. Okay, so I've just finished the other pocket, and I'm actually so happy with how they look. I was kind of nervous that I wasn't going to like them or anything, but they turned out so good. Um, anyways, I just want to thank you guys for watching this video. Staying tuned in. Um, 
I hope you enjoyed it. And also, I just wanted to say that, like, you don't have to do the same designs I did. You could do anything. I was just trying to make mine, like, something that I would like because they're mine, which sounds really selfish. But, like, so, anyways, thanks for watching. Um, catch you later.